Terry Frack Multi Automatic Reusable Terry Paratide Pen Injector. Welcome to this quick guide which will instruct you how to use the automatic Terry Paratide Pen Injector Terry Frack Multi. This pen ensures an easy and safe method of the accurate dosing of your Terry Paratide. The automatic spring assisted delivery system will enable you an effortless injection of the desired dose of Terrifrag 20 microgram at a constant speed. You will also appreciate the positioning of the release button at the side of the pen body, which is thus easy to reach and enables you to firmly position your hand during the process of the injection. 1. Before you inject, in order to start using the Terrifrag Multi Automatic Pen Injector, you must have the pen injector the terry frack cartridge a 32 gauge 4 mm pen needle make sure you have washed your hands before you start using the pen 2 installation of cartridge pull out the cap you will then see the transparent cartridge holder. Unscrew it by turning it counterclockwise. If the position rod sticks up, press it into the pen body. Insert Terry Frack cartridge into the cartridge holder, rubber tip to the front. Attach the cartridge holder to the pen body by turning it clockwise. Remember, you may not use any other Terry Paratide cartridge than Terry Frack. 3. Installation of Pen Needle Now your pen is ready for the needle attachment. Needles recommended for use with Terry Frack Multi are 32 gauge, 4 mm pen needles. To attach the needle, rip off the paper tab from the outer needle shield and then attach the outer needle shield to the cartridge holder by turning it clockwise. Remove the outer needle shield. Remember to keep it in order to remove the needle after the completion of the injection process. Remove the inner needle shield and dispose it. 4. Priming of pen. Before performing any injection, you must prime your pen. Priming is necessary in order to remove any air from cartridge and from the needle tube. Using the dose selector, choose two testing units of Terry Paratide. In order to do this, turn the dose selector clockwise until the figure 20 comes up. Now, hold the pen with the needle facing upward. Using your thumb, slide the trigger in the direction of the needle. Hold the trigger until a green dot appears in the window, signalizing the end of the injection. You should see a drop of Terry Paratide at the end of the needle. If a drop of Terry Paratide does not appear, then dial the two testing units again and prime your pen with the needle facing upwards again. 5. Prepare the injection site. Prepare the injection site, upper arm, upper thigh or abdomen as directed by your doctor. 6. Set dose for injection. In order to select the amount of Terry Paratide you want to inject, Turn the dose selector clockwise until you see the desired figure, which corresponds to the number of Terry Paratide microliters you want to inject. 7. Inject Dose Now grasp the pen injector firmly with your thumb snugly on the release button and rest of your fingers holding the cartridge holder. Lean your wrist against your body to stabilize your hand and then Insert the end of the needle into the subcutaneous tissue. Using your thumb, slide the release button in the direction of the needle. The injection is almost painless as the Terry Paratide is administered smoothly under the constant speed. Hold the trigger until a green dot appears in the window signalizing the end of the injection. Count to 10 and then remove the needle. If the green dot didn't appear, it means that Terry Paratide in the cartridge is over. Remember the number of units you see in the dose selector window. It corresponds to the number of units of Terry Paratide, which you must enter to complete the injection by using a new cartridge.
8. After injection. After the injection is over, put the outer needle shield on the needle. Rotate the outer needle shield counterclockwise. Remove the used needle. Put your pen cap back on. You have completed your teriparatide injection.